There's a reason Sand Hollow Reservoir just north of St. George is called the Little Lake Powell. It's Red Rock shoreline and gin clear water is only part of the equation. The lake also kicks out bass in abundance like its larger cousin. Pop in that jig and uh, I just felt him pick it up and he uh, just made my day a lot nicer. A lot of these fish will be uh, moving into the shallows to spawn very soon. Some are already in. Again, the diversity of Sand Hollow is absolutely magnificent. You can catch fish deep right now. You can catch them on crankbaits, spinner baits. You can catch them on uh, getting ready to bed up. Four or five different methods you can catch them right now, and it's, it's a fabulous time of year. It's a small window. It's uh, maybe six weeks long, and it's just barely starting. So if you have the opportunity to come down to Sand Hollow, it would be my recommendation. For Greg Giacomazza, days on the lake are both work and play. As a professional bass guide, Greg spends hundreds of days on the water, but he never tires of exercising Sand Hollow's population. All these fish are very, very healthy. They're thick through the back, they're eating so good. Beautiful fish, beautiful fish. The next few weeks we'll see large numbers of fish and large fish as the bass complete their spawn. Gorgeous, gorgeous fish. It's a perfect opportunity for those who can't get down to Powell to sample some of the best bass fishing the state has to offer. <laughs>